throw a punch at Poudelaire. Poudelaire wasn't even watching. Miller wants to get out to Nyland. He's being held by Kevin. Nyland. Oh, Nyland took a swing at Lindsman. Here we go. This will clear the benches. Here we go. Perry O'Reilly trying to hold off Mike McPhee and Patrick Rowan. Who's he going with down the runway? Scrooglet. Addressing the elephant in the room, so we might as well start with the brawl in the hall, right? Yeah, <laughs> with my shirt. I want to get to that, and I remember that night, the shit that happened, a great rivalry between two original six teams. And, you know, fuck, I didn't trust you. And no one fucking trusted you, and sure, no one trusted me, and I get it. But yeah. I'm coming off the ice, and every time I come off the ice in Boston, Tim, you know, I go through the runway there, I, I have a fight or something, I did something crazy, and people throw beers and fucking pizza, everything at you, right? So I'm coming off, it, it, and... You have, to come by, you have to come by our bench. Which is stupid. <laughs> yeah. right. What do you think's going to happen? <laughs> yeah. So... I'm heading over and I'm just fucking fired up. The adrenaline is just running through my veins. And Kenny's standing up on the end of the bench. He turned, it, he stood up, and I'm going, fuck this. What's he going to do? And I said, you know what? I'm going to fucking Shit. crack him before anything. So I threw a shot at him. And as soon as I threw the shot, um, people grabbed at me, but I slipped on the, the, um, the rubber mat, you know, they're all wet there. And I slipped like that. And then the rat came after me. And down the <laughs> hall we went. And we all roll out into the hallway. And he fucking scratching at me. I remember, I, I saw the replay after. I have a big scratch down here. I'm there. You fucker. I'm, yeah. Uh, <laughs> uh, I miss you. From yeah, your yeah, point miss of you. view. What, what is it from your point of view that night? I want to hear it. Well, first off, what uh, what pissed you off on the ice when you're getting kicked out? Do you remember what happened? Yeah, um, I bef before I when I was well, what happened? Uh, you know, there was a little altercation, and and Jay ended up with Chelios somehow at the beginning, and I was trying to get to Chelios to get him off, and I got grabbed by Boutillier who's not a fighter and I told him let, let, let go of me and he said I can't I can't I said let go of me I'm gonna fucking drop you and then I threw a shot at him I almost I missed him I just grazed his jaw if I ever hit him I would have caved his face in but and then partners. now watch Chris Nyland on Paul Boudelier he suckers him knocks him down him, but, and then it went crazy I got kicked out Jay wants to get me Cuckoo Curran wants to get me everybody and so I'm, I'm, I'm amped up. So I, I'm looking at you coming off the ice, and I'm like, he's going to do something. I can tell how fired up you are. And Jeff Corton, you know, I always sat on the end of the bench because I had such long legs, you know, because uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, I needed to stretch him out. But Jeff Corton came from the other end of the bench because he knew you were going to do something. And he was right behind me. So I stood up because I wasn't going to get punched in the head sitting there. And sure enough, sure enough, <laughs> you did something. Everybody, everybody, you know, just just insinuated that I said something to you. I feel like you we probably even looked into it. And I definitely, I mean, there was no point in saying anything to you. I didn't need to get you fired up. But Well, I asked him before. I was like, what did he say to you? He's like, he looked at me. <laughs> That's <all he> <laughs> the showers but here he has to go through the bench and he gives the rat a shot and now look what's happening